Hello everybody, welcome back. Nintendo Lapia here, and I cannot believe it's already been five years since I've created this channel. Like, this channel has evolved a lot since 2015, and it's been pretty crazy, and hopefully these next five years will be even crazier. Oh yeah, guys, do you like my shirt? It's really cool. I wanna see you one more time, and if it's over, please tell me. Hey, about this percentage of you guys are not subscribed to the channel. So if you want the backwards Mario head to turn in the right way, you'd honestly appreciate it. And also, I would appreciate it. Anyways, play my intro. <laughs> I'll stand just like a statue, just like you. Acting like the sky's just about to fall. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. It's Lippy here. And guys, I got a new camera. If you guys, well, you probably already noticed because I'm like further away. But, um, yes, I did get a new camera. It's actually a Canon EOS Rebel T7. And at the moment, I'm kind of experimenting with the camera angle because I need to get, like, a new tripod where it can kind of go back to where my original camera angle was. And also, if I look far away, it's because, literally, it was a pain just trying to figure out the best way to set this angle up and everything. So if that looks different, that's why. But anyways, into the actual video. Um, Six years ago today... The Nintendo Lapeer channel was born. Now, last year was very important because it was my five-year anniversary. So that's why the intro was more sentimental, even though I headed it poorly. But um, this year, um, it's just another year until pretty much I hit the Big Ten. So anyways, if you're new to this channel, I do this tradition where I talk about my favorite commentary video and my least favorite. And also, I will talk about my favorite Let's Play and my least favorite. But due to me never really finishing them in a year, I'll pretty much be talking about my ongoing Let's Plays. Which, when I get to that category, I will kind of explain more on. Then, after I talk about my commentaries and Let's Plays, I'm going to talk about some small things and pretty much what will be done. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. The commentary series is probably one of my most popular things on my channel, and actually this year the series turned five years old. This year I made over nine commentary videos, which is two more from last year, which I'm honestly really happy about. I made some great commentaries such as talking about my horrible luck with headphones, or why I play the guitar, or that one time I attempted to try to host a Nintendo trivia show. Now, out of nine of these commentary videos, which is my favorite? Well, I would have to say my ranking my favorite Twitch streamers has to be one of my favorites. Like, the video was fun to record, and plus I got to talk about streamers I actually enjoy watching. Watching. Plus, I ever since like late 2017, I've slowly become like a Twitch frog and now I watch Twitch as much as YouTube now. Now, the one thing that bothers me about this video is the quality of the recording because literally I was using Camtasia's built-in recording software. But other than that, I really love this video. Well, now... So out of the nine commentary videos I made this year, which one did I not really like? Well, um, I actually like all my commentary videos I made this year, but if I could have improved any of them this year, I would definitely have the wish to improve the Nintendo trivia one. Like I remember I uploaded it and then I had to take it down right away to fix something in it. And all I can say is just working on this video was pure hell and... Um, but in the end, it did turn out to be a classic on my channel because it featured many funny moments from my friends. But, um, definitely in 2022, if I do another type of one of these videos, I hope to do it way better. Or, well, whatever the correct grammar is. Now, to further explain what I meant in the intro, um, last year and the year prior, I did not include the worst Let's Play because I only had, like, two Let's Plays going on and I want it to be fair. Now, this year, I want to talk about pretty much my ongoing Let's Plays that are going on. Like, for example, I finished Banjo-Kazooie at the beginning of this year, but I'm not going to include it because it is not an ongoing let's play <laughs> but anyways um my currently my two ongoing let's plays are mario kart wii which is a new and ongoing let's play and ocarina of time which i started back in like 2019 and i still have not finished it so now will ocarina of time get a redemption arc from losing last year well i hate to break it to you but the young buck mario kart wii takes the cake now first i'll talk about why i chose mario kart and in the next segment i'll pretty much talk about why i did not choose ocarina of time but mario kart wii was a new let's play i started so i can kind of spice things up but honestly, I've really been enjoying recording this Let's Play, and it feels good to replay a game that I haven't really beaten and finally years later attempting to 100% it, since I was never really able to. And honestly, I can't wait to get further in the game and see pretty much what I missed out on for so many years. 
Now you're probably wondering, why is Ocarina of Time the worst? Now, don't get me wrong, I still really love this game, and if I hated it, I would have Let's Played it. This Let's Play has one flaw, which is I have to constantly look things up so I can make sure I 100% this game. So a lot of research and using my brain pretty much comes from when recording or playing this game. Now again, don't get me wrong, I still love playing this game, and honestly, I cannot wait to go through all the adult temples when I finally get a video cable for my N64, because at the moment, I've been messing with my GameCube one, and I don't want to have to use my GameCube video cable for my N64, so I'm just going to try to get my own N64, my own standalone N64 video cable, so, and hopefully I can finally finish this Let's Play so we can put it to rest, and so it doesn't have to be in another one of these videos. Now, last year for honorable mentions, I talked about my trilogy of Antcraft videos I made. Now, actually, this year, I made another video on a Minecraft server called Scotland Studios, which was a server run by Zach Scott Games, and pretty much I talked about what happened to the server. And crazy enough, Zach himself actually commented on the video, and it honestly made me so happy because I used to watch a lot of Zach's videos back in the day, and just from time to time, I'll just check up on his channel and see what he's doing. Also, um, I want to give a mention to my Wii Sports grind that I've been doing over my Twitch channel, which is twitch.tv slash here which would be linked down below which it, it, like this year i brought down my all sports speed by over one minute because in 2019 i had a 958 and for a while i didn't really touch the category because i was really intimidated by baseball but this year i started with a 958 and i brought it to a 827 which honestly it took a lot of work to get and i'm really proud of that time and also another crazy thing i also brought down my all sports no baseball pb by over one minute which i start off the year with 506 with a five minute five huh? five minute and six minute pe what no a five minute and six second pb there that's what i was trying to say and i ended off the year with a 449 which again listen i don't know how to split at the ending i'm being serious literally like i used to split where it would just hit, like hit the ko thing which i'll probably have a visual on screen for because i don't want to look stupid doing that like i would split at that time but then nomad who is a really well-known runner of the game he mentioned how i kind of split it late and he's like oh you split it this time or that time listen i don't i don't know how to split at it literally i could i could have gotten a 448 which is what i thought i get because on my splits it was 448 but the mods re timed it, it was a 449 so i again i don't know but I'm really still happy about the time. And thanks to my Wii Sports grind, I was actually able to get affiliate on Twitch, which honestly, it was really tough at times. I'm not going to lie, but I'm really happy with what I did with this game this year. And hopefully next year, I will do more crazy things in Wii Sports and actually bring my times down even lower. Or heck, maybe I'll actually play Mario for once. Anyways, that is all for this video. Um, if the lighting looks dark, because in editing, I noticed it was really dark, and even looking on the footage of my camera, it was extremely dark. And again, I'm still experimenting with things. Like, I really hope soon I can get a new tripod that goes lower and not like this high. And another thing, you know what annoys me? Literally, I recorded the bit for Worst Let's Play, Honorable Mentions, and this end part here. I literally recorded it earlier, but I had to re-record all of it because I was out of focus. So... I, I have a lot to learn with how these kind of cameras work, so and hopefully over time I will improve my camera angle, improve my lighting, and everything will look 10 times better. And also another thing, um, my 400 sub special. I, yes, I know I hit 400 subscribers. I know that. Don't worry. I, I definitely know. Um, but to get my 400 sub, my 400 sub special out, I, I don't know when it's going to come out because I want to consistently be over 400 subscribers. Because when I first hit 400 subscribers, literally the next day, I lost all those subs and I was back at like 398. And I don't want to release this video when I'm under 400. So, um, yeah, I don't know when it's going to come out. I've said that two times already. I genuinely don't care. And yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.